Much of the upper part of Mount Everest is composed of sedimentary rock, like this chunk of limestone in my hand. Sedimentary rocks are usually deposited on the seafloor as flat line horizontal beds. As the sediment gets compacted, it's converted into rock layers that later get uplifted and tilted and folded and faulted to form mountains like the Himalayas. So today when we look at Mount Everest, we see these rocks no longer flat, but sitting up there inclined, dipping down into the earth. We can use a compass to measure the angle of dip and record that information in our field notebooks. Thank you.